that we can purify ourselves after urinating or defecating through two means and ways either by washing and this is the purest of all or by wiping okay what about passing of wind sheikh he did not mention how to purify from that there is no purification from passing the wind and actually if someone washes himself after just passing wind this is an innovation done by the shia or some uh, cults or, or sects of the shia so the washing process is called istinja and the wiping process is called istijmar so what is istinja istinja is washing the private parts with water and what do we wash actually see when the impurity comes out of your body it comes out from a specific place so once you're over and finished you simply wash that opening or that place in your body with water so that there would be no impurity at the surface or outside of that organ of yours wiping is the same thing now wiping can be done by stones or small rocks because this is what they had at the time and this was more convenient because it's everywhere but you can also use a piece of cloth you can use toilet tissues you can use anything that is solid and has a rough surface because if it has a soft surface it cannot purify it cannot cleanse so it has to have some such a uh, uh, a rough surface where the impurity would stick into it and it would cleanse your body and the best of both and the best is to use both so if someone defecates uses tissue paper and then washes the area with water that would be uh, a win-win situation